Good morning, ma'am. Morning, how are you? Doing good, how are you doing? Great, thank you very much. What's that? I thank you for Oh, you're welcome. What brings you out here today? What what is your what does your pro life look like, ma'am? My pro life looks like mm -hmm. I'm very much against abortion, but I don't I don't agree with showing these to my grandson. Right, I, I understand I understand you're against abortion. What what does that and look I also like though? I don't believe that that you should be videotaping these kids without their parents' permission and putting it up on YouTube. That's against the law number one. Actually, it's not, ma'am. But thank you. But what what does your pro life look like? What exactly does it look like? See, a lot of people have a good moral opinion. They think. Oh, I know. I know what it is, and well, I know exactly what happens, and I know exactly what takes place. Right. So, right. what what does your pro life look like? See, like if if somebody was beating him up, would you say, "Well, I'm against people beating him up, and I'll stand here holding a sign saying hater blocker." No. So what does it look like? You would defend him, right? I would defend him, right. but I also would not show pictures like this to uh, a, a minor, number one. If the parents want their children to see this, mm -hmm. then that's up to them. That's not up to you to show that. And I feel very much against letting my children and my grandchildren see photos like this. I will show that to them mm -hmm. if I deem that's appropriate. I have a grandson who is very much against abortion. Well, what does that look like? And um, it. What does that look like, ma'am? That's what I'm asking you. What does it look like? You see, so you could be against something. Look like to you. This this yeah. looks like murder, ma'am. It does look like murder. Okay. Yes, I agree with you. That's it what it looks like. It looks like, like murder. It does look like murder. So if it, it does, if it is actually I don't murder. To have my child see that from you, I would rather show that to them myself. Fine, ma'am. That's 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 fine. But that's not what I'm asking you. Okay. I'm asking you, what does your pro life look like, ma'am? See, if, if somebody was being murdered, would you stand there and say, I, you know, I'm against this? I, I would not stand there. I would do something about so, it. So I would what, not graphically show pictures. So what does your pro-life look like, ma'am? What are you doing to rescue the widow and the orphan, the oppressed, to defend those being led to the slaughter? What does that look like? See, a lot of people have this pro-life mindset that, hey, I have a good moral opinion. I do. I have a very good moral opinion. That's, that's wonderful, ma'am. I am ma totally against murder and I am totally against abortion. That's wonderful, ma'am. Yeah. But what does that look like? What See, do you, what you, do you keep asking me what it looks like. Because it looks exactly to have a good moral it's opinion. Not, it's not for you who do, does not know my child, who does not know my grandson, to stand here and show him this picture. It's my right to do that. Mm -hmm. And if I want to go online, if I want to go uh, in front of whatever, the, the clinics and whatever, I will do that. But I will not stand in a school where there are children. That are having sex and are killing children. Have you ever been to an abortion clinic, ma'am? Yes, I have. Have you? Yes, I have. Who have you seen going in? A lot of young kids, a lot of uh, middle-aged, so, a lot of a lot of twenties and thirty-year-olds, and a lot of young kids. Okay, so obviously they're not getting the message if they think that going in to murder your child is okay. Is that correct? That's absolutely correct. So who's giving them the message? Obviously, the way you're thinking that well, I'll do it in my time and I'll show them what I want to show them as they're going in to murder their children. You see, unfortunately, this is a place that is very for murdering children. Yes, it is, ma'am. And you standing here is, is a prime example of that. You standing here showing these pictures to our kids, I think is inappropriate. Well, I'm glad. I, mean, I, I think, think, I think if murdering you, if children. You stand here and say, I'm against abortion, that's fine. And I'll ask and you again, picture. what does that look like? What does your against abortion look like? You could be against Santa Claus and you don't do anything about it. All right? What does your against you abortion no look idea. like? You don't know anything about That's why I'm asking you, ma'am. You see, you. the Bible says, come, let's talk. Let's reason together, yeah, saith the Lord. You're sitting here, you know, uh, telling me that I don't know what I'm doing. I'm, no, I didn't, did I say that you didn't know what you were doing? Now you're putting words in my mouth. I'm asking you a simple question. What does it look like? 
What does your pro-life look like? What does your thinking, this is murder, it is looks murder. like? It it, looks, would you it have... Looks like this. Would you have... It looks like this. That's and right. It looks like this. No. But I do not agree with showing these pictures... To, to people that might be killing their children. My, to my grandson and to uh, some of the other kids. Do you know that these kids are only 15 and 16 here? Yeah. Yes. And I know that some of them are probably having sex, but I don't know that they're going to the abortion clinic. Well, ma'am, you're deceiving yourself. Maybe then. I am. I okay. don't, but I can't speak for that. I don't know that for sure. Uh -huh. I don't know that for a hundred percent sure that these kids at this school are doing that. That these kids at this school are doing that. I know. This is the only school in Texas where the kids aren't killing their children. No, I'm just saying I don't know that they are or are not. So you would you would rather assume that they're not and say what wonderful kids they are, while all the other kids are doing it. I'm not arguing with you, ma'am. You see, the un the unfortunate thing is you don't have an answer for what your pro life look like. Your pro life actually looks like I'm standing against people standing for. I already told you what my pro life looks for, and you keep saying I'm not told you. It's because I'm not giving you the answer that you want to hear. So I'm going to go over to the other side. No, actually, ma'am, you're giving me the answer that most pro-life people do. You have a good moral opinion. Unfortunately, ma'am, your good moral opinion means nothing. Texas has 13,000 kids right now in foster care waiting to be adopted. But the Christians don't care. They don't want to adopt them because they're not babies. Christians in these, all these churches around here, they want babies. So they'll do IVF or they'll pay 30 grand to go buy a baby from China or from Korea. But the 13,000 kids right here in Texas in foster care waiting to be adopted are rotting in foster care. With gays and lesbians adopting them and Christians totally ignoring them as well as child sacrifice being the number one cause of death in Texas. And people who go to church every Sunday are apathetic. Abortion is murder, it's sin, and it's people like you, ma'am, why it happens and why it's ignored. You have no idea and nothing about me. You know nothing about me, so don't That's not true. And judge and say I can judge you. I, I can judge you. You live in Texas, all right? You, you say you're pro-life. The only all right. person that can judge me is God. So. That's not true. That's what black rappers who hate God say. I can do whatever I want. You can't judge me. That's what. The, that's not what the Bible says. It says to I'm, judge I'm rightly. Not standing here judging you, so don't stand there and judge me. And what are you talking about? You're calling me a hater. You are judging me. You're being a hypocrite. You're being a hypocrite, ma'am. Morning. You are, you are, you're being a hypocrite. 